Hi, I'm Bob Hasegawa, your state senator for the 11th Legislative District, and welcome to our first video to introduce us all to the 66th Legislature of the state of Washington. So uh, 66th Legislature will write the budget that will last for two years, and then the 67th Legislature will have to clean up after us. But for the time being, we have just started sessions. So we've had opening day ceremonies, and then we've heard the uh, governor give his State of the State address, and today we heard the State of the Judiciary address, which we actually did not do a couple of years ago for different reasons that I can probably talk off line about. But with this session, it's a 105-day session, so we'll be writing the two-year budget, as I mentioned. It's probably going to be a little over $50 billion by the time it's all said and done, which seems like a lot of money, and it is. But we've got a lot of catch-up to do because since the 2008 recession happened, we've cut over $11 billion out of the maintenance level of the budget. So we're still trying to do a lot of catch-up, and then on top of that, we've had our McCleary obligation, as you've probably heard of. Uh, so uh, we've got a lot of work cut out for us, but uh, we're excited about it all. So what I wanted to do was show you, I've got a stack here. These are, a lot of the, these are some of the bills that I've filed already. So you can see we're busily trying to look out for the interests of y'all. These are file, uh, bills that are in process, and uh, we'll be filing those here shortly. Uh, we also have a, a new little shift in the Senate, at least this year, and that is that we have elected three new members of color. One is a son of an immigrant family from uh, Vietnam. Another one is Indian heritage, South Asian Indian heritage. Another woman is uh, Latina. That has expanded the number of people of color in the Senate by 60%, believe it or not. Sounds like a huge number, but we're up to 8 Members of color now, so yay, go us. So we formed this thing called the Members of Color Caucus so that we can leverage our power to make sure that communities of color's needs whose voices are disproportionately soft in our legislative process, we amplify our voice for our communities by bending ourselves together and uh, making sure that our community's interests are, are met. So that's what this one is about. Uh, I've also got a bunch of operating budget requests, capital budget requests, transportation budget requests. I've got folders for the cities in our district, uh, Tequila, Renton, Seattle, Kent, with their issues. There's seven school districts in the 11th Legislative District, you might be surprised to hear. So uh, we've got a lot of work cut out for us that we're trying to make sure that the 11th District is well represented and taken care of. And then I've got these for when we don't get the stuff that we need. And I've got the voice of wisdom and logic right behind me, guiding me along the path, Mr. Spock, as you can see. This is my um, office, by the way, which you're probably pretty familiar with by now. I've been here for a little while. So I also wanted to introduce you to my staff for this session. We're going to do a little be real cut in of them doing their job representing you and being your first point of contact when you contact my office. So my legislative assistant is Sam Cho. You may be familiar with him already. I think I introduced you to him last year. Jenny Chang is my session aide and uh, she'll be doing a lot of the phone work and some of the uh, email responses. And Isha Nath is also going to be working with Jenny uh, as a first point of contact for my office. So please feel free to call me uh, or email me. Those numbers will be scrolling at the bottom of your screen here um, right now, hopefully. So, uh, well, with that, wish me luck. We're going in and hitting the ground running for this brand new legislative session. And I'll get back to you in a couple of weeks with a report on how we're doing. So thanks for watching. Again, I'm Bob Hasegawa your state senator for the 11th district.